pixel measurements, more pixel measurements, and did I mention pixel measurements? Coming up when I answer the question, how strong is Link from The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild really? For this question, we will take a look at his sword swing from Breath of the Wild. To figure out how much force that swing has, we need to look at the force equation. Force is equal to mass times acceleration. Let's look at the first part of the equation, mass. Mass is equal to volume times density. To figure out volume, we need to do a lot of pixel measurements. We need to figure out how long the master sword is. To figure that out, we need to figure out how tall Link is and compare it to the master sword. We can estimate Link's height from this picture from Ocarina of Time. As you can see, there are markings on the walls. Those measure in meters, so we can measure Link's height at about 1.6 meters. Now using this footage of Link with the Master Sword and some pixel measurements, we can find the length of the Master Sword at 0.9216 meters, and the width is 0.05973 meters. To figure out the volume, we need to find out the surface area of it. To figure that out, we split the sword into a rectangle and a triangle. Then we figure out the area of both of them and add them and get 0.518 and a bunch of other numbers square meters. We don't know the thickness of the sword, so we'll just assume it's 3 millimeters. Doing this gives us a volume of 0.00155 and more numbers cubic meters, or about 155.6 cubic centimeters. Now to figure out its density, we need to know what material it's made out of. Uh, the Zelda wiki says it's made out of fine steel, but I couldn't really find a density for fine steel. So I use the material that is most commonly used to make swords, high carbon steel. High carbon steel has an average density of about 8 grams per cubic centimeter. Multiplying them together gives us a mass of 1,244.7471 grams, or about 1.24 and more numbers kilograms. Now the second part of the equation acceleration. To figure this out, we need to do... Using these three frames from Link swinging his sword and the distance the sword travels, we can figure out that the acceleration is 53.6 and more numbers meters per second per second. Multiplying the two together gives us a grand total of... 66 newtons. That's kind of small. Huh. That's... That, that's not much at all. Uh, yeah, you think? Well, well, that's disappointing. DISAPPOINTED! Just, j just, just give me a sec, would you? Hey! What, what? Dude, this is such a bad video idea. Why would you suggest it to me? You were the one who asked how strong Link is. Well, I didn't know that this would be such a boring video. Okay, okay, w what do you want me to do? I don't know, just make this video not boring. Okay, uh, what if you just make something up? You think they won't notice? It's worth a, it's worth a shot. Okay, alright, uh, let me just uh, multiply this by a, a thousand and oh my god! Link can exert... 66,000 newtons of force. That's like 15,000 pounds force and definitely not made up. I just, you know, forgot to multiply the answer by a thousand. You know, standard stuff. Not made up. Totally. <laughs> 